Why, hello, this is James coming at you with another awesome video. Now, we're still looking at email marketing, okay? Now, today we're going to look at what you should do with regards to email subject lines, okay? We're going to go over some things that you should do, all right? Now, remember <clears throat> to like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Like share and subscribe okay uh i accept requests if there's a video you would like for me to create uh by the affiliate links uh drop me a note leave a comment okay it needs to be about affiliate links how to promote them how to get one something with regards to uh, affiliate links uh like share and subscribe okay um pma positive mental attitude is just nowhere around it you must have a positive mental attitude kick those negative thoughts to the curb take massive action every day massive action every day be a person of thanks there is greatness within you are designed for greatness uh, so let's go ahead and get started with today's uh, video okay so the, in this video we're going to look at uh, things that you should do with regards to uh, subject lines with email marketing okay so use the emoji symbols use the emoji symbols uh, create a sense of urgency things you should do personalize add some personalization personal touch uh, write catchy subject lines catchy subject lines uh, enhance readability for mobile devices and then provide an opportunity to unsubscribe okay now so let's let's look at the the first thing that you should do is use the emojis okay um, now emojis have they have a emotional connection um, there's emotional connection with the customer it also sets the tone of the email it sets the tone of the email and this will boost your email open rate okay using the emojis uh, will um, there will be an emotional connection it sets the tone for the email and then it will also boost your open rate okay second thing you should do is create a sense of urgency create a sense of urgency uh, you want them to take immediate action take immediate action give them a reason why they should take immediate action give you a reason why okay uh promote this is being promoted for a limited time offer limited time deals okay make sure there's like a, a ending point for the deal that you're offering uh see uh expiration dates okay include an expiration date Uh, personalization okay you should add some type of personalization uh, to the subject line and one of the ways that you can do this is by using the first name okay using the first name in the subject line using the first name okay uh, use the subject line to ask a question ask the question okay to the reader ask the question to the reader and then another way you can do that is highlight uh, the customer's interest. This is another way that you can do that is highlighting uh, the customer's interest. Uh, the fourth way is to write catchy email subject lines. Write catchy email subject lines. Okay. Uh, catchy email subject lines uh, will arise the recipient's uh, curiosity. Curiosity without being spammy you don't want it to be spammy uh, okay because if it's spammy it will appear in the, the junk folder uh, also with catchy subjects with catchy subject lines this will increase your open rate and the readers want to learn more about your offer okay they want to learn more about your offer 
Uh, okay, now uh, make sure that enhance your readability for mobile devices. 75% uh, of the people will read their email through a mobile device. So you want to make sure that your email can be seen uh, uh, clearly on mobile devices. There are certain strategies uh, that you utilize for that. Uh, and then you need to make sure that your subject lines are short. Uh, the, with the email, you need to make sure that they, you know, maybe about seven, eight, maybe ten words per line. Okay. You don't want to have a real uh, lengthy line because it'll just go crazy when viewed on those mobile devices. Uh, let's see, then get straight to the point. Okay, get straight to the point. And then the other thing that you should do is provide an opportunity for them to subscribe, okay? Now that they are a member of the list, they may want to unsubscribe. So make sure that you have a very clear uh, path for them to unsubscribe, okay? Unsubscribe. Uh, they will want to unsubscribe from time to time. Provide a very clear way or a clear path for them to opt out opt out of, of unwanted emails and then once they have requested uh, to unsubscribe just don't send them any emails any longer okay respect their request and stop sending them emails all right okay so let's do a quick review of the things that you should do should do uh, to get higher open rates one use emojis use emojis Two, create a sense of urgency. Create a sense of urgency. Uh, number three, personalization. Add personalization. Four, write catchy subject lines. Write catchy subject lines. Uh, five, enhance readability for mobile devices. Okay, make sure that the letter can be read on a mobile device clearly. And then the last thing that you should do is make sure that there is a way for the for them to unsubscribe or to opt out. They opt in. Make sure there's a way for them to opt out. Okay, so this has been James. We just looked at uh, things that you should do uh, in your subject lines to increase your open rate. Uh, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Like share and subscribe if there's a particular video uh, you would like for me to create with regards to uh, affiliate link marketing uh, drop me a note leave me a comment okay i do accept requests i accept requests uh, let me know what strategies are working for you leave me a comment let me know what's working for you and also kind of let me know what's not working because we look at different two strategies techniques and best practices okay for promoting affiliate links uh, you must take massive action every day every day every day massive action there's just nowhere around this massive action every day can be a person of action pma positive mental attitude success leaves clues there's what is you are designed for something great okay and what is special about you is greatness, okay? Uh, PMA, positive mental attitude. Massive action every day. Be a person of thanks. PMA, positive mental attitude. Okay. Now, like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. All right. Now, let me speak this over you. Until we meet again, may the Lord continue to bless you. May he smile upon you. May he grant you his favor. May he give you his peace, and may he continue to enlarge your territory. This has been James. Have a great day. Why, hello, this is James coming at you with another awesome video about uh, how to promote affiliate links. Now, in this video, we're going to look at things that you should not do in a subject line for your emails, what you should not do. This is the purpose of this video, what you should not do.
do. Okay. Now, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. Okay. Uh, I do accept requests. So if there is a particular subject you would like for me to create a video about uh, with regards to uh, 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 affiliate link marketing, uh, leave me a comment, drop me a note. Uh, I would love to do that. Okay, no problems. Also, uh, let me know what you, what strategies are working for you, but more importantly, what strategies are not working for you. Okay, success leaves clues. PMA, positive mental attitude is just nowhere around this. You must have a positive mental attitude. Success leaves clues. Success leaves clues. You must be a thankful person. Promote every day. Promote, promote, promote every day. You have the knowledge. Uh, you have the understanding. Now it's time to execute. It's time to put that knowledge and understanding into action. Okay. Become a person of action. A person that takes massive action every day. All right. There is greatness within. You are designed for greatness. Remember to like share and subscribe like share and subscribe so let's go ahead and get started with this video about things you should not do uh, with uh, email marketing all right so here are some things that you should not do uh, do not uh, use uh, spam in your subject lines okay do not use spam in your subject lines uh, spammy words or spammy strategies. Uh, do not use all caps. When you use all caps, it's like you're shouting. Okay? And then do not write a long email subject line. Okay, now, spamming. Now, if, if you have created something that looks like spam, it will end up in the junk folder. Okay? Now, the email providers are taking a much closer look they're cracking down on spammy emails okay so if you write something that appears to be spammy it will end up in the junk folder and that defeats uh, the purpose of creating the email because it won't go to, into their inbox it'll go into the junk folder um okay and i read flags now, these are red flags, uh, some things that you will do that will create a red flag and will be considered as spammy, okay? Uh, one word subject lines, one word subject lines, spelling errors, this like a re, okay? And then multiple exclamation points. If you use these uh, techniques here, if you employ this as part of your email campaign, uh, it will end up in the spam folder. Um, one word subject lines, uh, errors, spelling errors, uh, the re, okay, like this in the subject line, and then multiple uh, exclamation points. So let's not do that. Okay, do not use all caps. All caps. Do not use all caps. When you use all caps, it's kind of like you're shouting, that you're yelling. And it will decrease your open rate. Okay, that's not necessary. I know people do this to uh, to emphasize, but you need to so don't do that. Uh, it will lower your response rate. It's going to lower your rate, and then you'll be reported as spam. Okay, and when you get that spam designation, your uh, all your items will go into the spam folder or the junk folder. Okay, do not write long emails. Your subject lines should not be long. Okay, should, should be no less, uh, no, no longer than 50 characters. And the reason this is happening is because people are checking their emails more with their mobile devices. Okay, and so there's a very limited space. Okay, so with that being said, you need to kind of make sure that your titles are not real lengthy. Okay, not real lengthy. Uh, it's not a whole lot of space. Uh, 50 characters. 
Okay, let's do a quick review here. Things you should not do. Uh, do not use spammy techniques as spammy strategies in the subject line. If you do, uh, it will end up in the junk folder. Uh, do not use all caps. Do not use all caps in the subject line. That's capital letters. Do not use all capital letters in the subject line. Uh, do not write a long email subject line, 50 characters. The reason you do not want to have a long subject line is because of the mobile devices. Okay. So, this has been James. We just uh, talked about, or I created this video about what you should not do when it comes to subject lines uh, uh, with email marketing. Okay. Things you should stay away from. Um, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. Uh, I do accept requests. Um, there is greatness within. You are designed for great things. Okay. Uh, PMA, positive mental attitude. You must take massive action every day. Every day, every day, every day, massive action. Okay. Uh, you have the knowledge. You have the understanding. Now apply your knowledge. Um, you are designed for great things. There is greatness within. PMA, positive mental attitude. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe, and leave a comment. Leave a comment. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and end this video. Let me speak this blessing over you. Uh, until we meet again, may the Lord continue to bless you. May he smile upon you. May he grant you his favor, give you his peace. And may he continue to enlarge your territory. This has been James. Have a great day.